hey guys you're welcome back in today's video i'll be showing you how to make the famous milky donuts and jam donuts so guys i have two clips of videos here so the first is for milky donuts while the second is for jam donuts so i want you to compare the two recipe and tell me which you prefer and which one will you be going for now let's begin with the milky donuts we'll go in with the three cups of flour then sieve it Add your sugar, two tablespoons, salt, one teaspoon, yeast, one tablespoon, whisk everything together. In another bowl, we'll break one egg and whisk it. To that, add your warm uh, milk, half cup, and put your two tablespoons of butter. In the flour mixture and mix everything together now add the the, the, the the egg mixture mix to combine everything and you're going to be kneading your donut knead it as if you are kneading bread knead it very well after that you allow it to rest allow the dough to rest for some time put it in a warm place now cover your dough and allow it to rest for one hour put it in a warm place now this is after one hour remove the foil and deflate the dough Then go ahead and fold it into ball. I'm going to be using a parchment paper or you can use newspaper, any kind of paper. Because you're going to be placing the ball on those papers. Fold into small balls and make sure the mouth is well sealed. Over it again why that is rising or why that is proving you go ahead and make your filling that is the milky filling go ahead mix your icing sugar with your milk in a pot add your flour add liquid milk Mix it together until there is no lumps. Then bring it to a boil on a low heat. Add one tablespoon of sugar. Now continue to stir it until it's very sticky, just like this. Then add the icing sugar and milk mixture to it and combine everything. can see our filling is ready our donut filling milky donut filling is ready so we'll set it aside and go ahead and fry our donuts fry your donut on a low heat make sure there is enough oil before you flip one side make sure it's already golden brown before you flip it Now go ahead and sprinkle some icing sugar. Then make a hole on the donut and add your filling, your milky filling. Wow, this donut is so tasty and delicious. I know you'll love to try it out. Now we head on to the second clip, which is our jam donut. Hi hey guys, you're welcome. In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you how to get spring light. In here is our recipe. 
to start first add all your dry ingredients now one kg of flour already sieved to that to we'll add 100 grams of milk flavor we'll add our sugar 200 grams yeast two tablespoon then we we'll mix everything together then we'll put 50 grams of butter and two large eggs so we are going to be adding the butter and eggs together you can choose to add it differently now you're going to be mixing everything thoroughly together mix it rub it in Now once that is done, you make a well and add your 500 ml of water. You can decide to use a warm water to make the yeast activate faster. So you can use room temperature water or warm water. But when you use warm water, it will help the yeast to activate faster, making your your dough after making after needing your dough to rise on time without taking much time so go ahead and bring it together after that we are going to be kneading this dough we'll need it like the way we need bread so clean your work surface and begin to knead knead it until very smooth and stretchy just like our bread for you to get that ring line on a donut you must invest your time in kneading you can see how the texture is looking now it's becoming what smooth and stretchy because if you don't need it like this you will not get that ring line if you don't need it to this extent you will not get that ring line so this is the secret of of getting the ring line one of the secrets one is to follow the recipe step by step Another thing is to do what? To knead your dough very well. So we are going to be molding it in two different shapes. We'll mold the round one and we'll mold the pillow donut. So we have different ways of molding it. So you can see what I'm doing now. Put it in your hand, fold it, place it on the work surface and use your hands and remove the excess. Then before that make sure that you have dust your uh, baking pan with flour so that you can be placing your molded dough inside it or you can decide to use um you can also place them on a paper you can cut some papers you know dust it floor and place your distance so we are making a ring line now 
ring line form so after molding it you press it down with your hand and use the cutter and cut it this is a ring form so Now after that, you allow put your door in a warm place and allow it to rise for like one hour or 40 minutes depending on the weather. So it's time for frying. You are going to be frying on a medium low heat. In a low heat. You don't fry with hot oil. If not, the inside will not get so done. Yes. So fry on a low heat. Make sure one side is already golden brown before you flip it. Very, very important. Once that is done, just go ahead and add your jam into the donut make a hole take your jam put it on a piping bag and add to the egg to the donuts thank you very much for watching